B-Rad Celebrity Hairstylist here, your host of the Hairstylist Empowerment Podcast. I want to thank our guest for coming today, Jonathan Pike, who's from BioVita, BioVita.com. He's going to discuss a new process, not really a new process, because a lot of times you think all shampoos are the same. He's going to show you maybe they're not. So this is something that was born in nature and refined in science. So I'm going to say welcome, Jonathan. Nice to be with you, Brad. Uh, look, I've been looking forward to this for a while, uh, looking to make people more aware of what they're doing when they chemically process hair and how to manage and maintain hair easier, quicker, with better results. Perfect. So if you're on the show for the first time, and so I get you to like, share, subscribe, comment, and uh, make sure you turn your notifications on. So Jonathan, Jonathan, tell me a little bit about your background. Well, it's, it's fairly diverse. I've done a plethora of jobs and trades and traits. Uh, I've just had enormous curiosity about life and the things that make it more valuable. And in those discoveries, I saw there was a great problem in hair uh, products, number one, but in processing. I was producing some shows. My background in the audio, uh, musical industry, I've I've done video editing, audio editing. I've done all that, produced shows for major hair brands. Uh, I previously was Clarell's Mr. Nice and Easy on Park Avenue. I was their senior colorist and national spokesperson. And I led a beautiful U tour across the United States to 50 markets in the middle of shopping malls in nine months with a crew of 15. And we went in and taught people how to select the right hair color shade. Do you want to be lighter, redder, or richer? And that's what myself, Mr. Nice and Easy, did to at least educate someone on selecting the right hair color shade. Now, the corrective chemistry was still not in play, and I had been working on that. That's what Uh, led Clarell to uh, kind of bring me off the streets of New York and and discuss things with me. And that led, of course, to doing the tour. So in that process, I discovered that one thing happened to hair. And you have to appreciate that with BioVita, we are a different category of chemistry. Uh, All products, and there's great products out there. There really are. But they work on a level of bonding or adhering something to the hair. And that's where I saw, okay, but how do we correct the damage in the hair was my number one concern. What's causing this damage? And and it continued through the second and the third services to the point it split, dissolved, or broke off. So my first salon out of hair school, Rivaldi's in Fort Worth, I found myself in Martina Natra Delova in my chair, a lot of other uh, of the social elite of Westover Hills of Fort Worth. And I had to up my game just right out of the chute. And I had a local lab there. We started working on the chemistry. And I discovered that in order to neutralize any hair product or a process, you had to be equal to or stronger than on the acid side. So if you're way up here in the alkaline scale, you needed to be equal to or stronger than on the acidic scale, not only to neutralize, but to physically shut that cuticle back down to its natural position. And that's what I've done with BioVita. We, we, we're, we're correcting the damage before it occurs after the process. That also, by the way, locks in hair color. So through these different uh, trials and tribulations and, and, and years of research, we came up with what I believe is a true corrective regimen. It is what I term a clean line, being that we don't use proteins. You know, proteins, uh, not getting too deep into that, mm-hmm. but they're, they're kind of like a... Uh, I guess you'd use putty on a nail hole in a wall. Mm -hmm. They're for filling in swollen cuticles to give them a more uh, straight approach. Mm -hmm. So what happens here is is that those proteins dry the hair out. Then you need something to lubricate the hair. And so you select whatever the favorite oil is today. Mm -hmm. And I'm not saying the hair doesn't need oil. In fact, with... um, with more ethnic hair, you need oil to indulate the curl and to activate the curl, and that's understood. But I deal specifically in correctives. So it's through a one, two, three step process. Mm -hmm. And then we get into the styling side with whatever you need for texturizing the hair. But the key principle was to have an effective regimen that corrected hair damage quickly, Mm -hmm. fast. 
Yeah, so with the, the, the products themselves, so when you decided to create something, what was the process like? Was it fairly easy? Did it take a number of years to develop? Um, did you do a lot of case studies, trial and error, before you brought it to market? Uh, yes, I did. Well, you could say that I guess my clients were my mm -hmm. successful experimenting uh, a platform or laboratory. Uh, I originally, I even looked at cryogenics and freezing okay. the hair to stop it. Wow. That was really, I was just starting <laughs> using that. And it was yes. from one step to the another, opened another door mm -hmm. and got me further in line to, okay, what was really causing the damage? Yes. And I, I got to think about the chirogenic. Well, like an icicle, I didn't want to be popping off hairs and breaking off hairs. So no. I came to the realization there was a product out. It had about a 2.5 pH, mm -hmm. came from France. It was in a hermetically sealed vial. Okay. And I saw, well, they had an idea of what needed to be done. It's like mm -hmm. we used to use vinegar in the yes. salon mm -hmm. to uh, descent perms, uh, yes. along with tomato juice. But these mm -hmm. were acidic materials in the yes. two to three range. Mm -hmm. and, and that kind of the light bulb went off. And I said, okay. And then mm -hmm. doing further study with Baylor and, and down at NASA, started doing the electron mm -hmm. microscope photos. I found that I saw where the cuticle moved mm -hmm. back. It's one thing to neutralize a chemical. And by the yes. way, neutralizing shampoos mm -hmm. neutralize the alkalinity of the water you're shampooing. Okay. With. They mm -hmm. do not have the strength to neutralize like a hair relaxer. Okay. The high 10, 11 pH, mm -hmm. hundreds of thousands of activity points. And neutralizing shampoo has a few hundred. So okay. the imbalance there was obvious. So mm -hmm. when I got into the discovery, it was to manufacture a product that was safe at a lower pH level. Mm -hmm. I got down to one pH. Yes. I saw the cuticle move. That was the magic when it happened. Mm -hmm. That's when everything happened. Because when you can stop breakage in one second, mm -hmm. and yes. being in, as a new, you have to appreciate being a new stylist. Mm -hmm. I was as confused as a lot of people about what these terms were and all these buzzwords they didn't yes. make sense to me chemically so mm -hmm. that's why I, I i dug deeper and i yes. found the true result so as a early stylist mm -hmm. just starting his career i had control of the hair i could manage the hair properly and that's mm -hmm. the big you know blow drying and getting tangles out and all that that takes a lot of time i, I eliminate mm -hmm. that time but what happened was it put me on a different level as far as my mm -hmm. credibility I yes. can speak the truth because the results are all that ever matters, mm -hmm. you know, uh, and who has, well, we don't have a lot of time to do things nowadays. So I wanted mm -hmm. something that was quick and effective. And that's what I came up with. Yeah. So with uh, BioVita Cure, uh, mm -hmm. that's the, the one pH product. It yes. truly is uh, a cure for all hair damage, regardless of ethnicity. Because one thing, Brad, mm -hmm. you know, I like to say hair is a texture. Yes. Not a skin color or mm -hmm. species. Exactly. It, it's yeah. all cuticle. And it's, mm -hmm. it's the expansion. Let's put it this way. Hair's like a ballpoint pin spring. Mm -hmm. If you stretch it too far, it can't go back. Mm -hmm. So as, as it's left open, we start depositing that protein in there and putting the oil over it. And that causes mm -hmm. the hair to lay down and collapse. Yes. Another indicator is a balloon. The mm -hmm. physical characteristics of a balloon. Okay. Uh, when you have a red balloon, it's opaque. It's mm -hmm. very rich in red color. What yes. happens when you blow it up? It becomes kind of pinkish, right? Mm -hmm. It gets yes. more translucent. Light passes through that. You mm -hmm. don't see the true pigment value of the color. Yes. And furthermore, you never neutralize that color at the mm. point you can't put it off. So that swollen cuticle with that color that's been deposited on there, you're mm -hmm. blow drying it, you're reactivating it, you're leaving the cuticle open, and that's where the color slips out. When you mm. come in with a product like Cure, you mm -hmm. come in with just a spritz. Yes. That right there neutralizes the color and starts physically mm. shutting the cuticle back down. So now we've taken that pink balloon and mm -hmm. contracted it back down to its original opaque color. Now yes. you have a tight, compact, very strong hair. The tensile mm -hmm. strength returns. The mm -hmm. color doesn't slip out, and it doesn't break after the second or third perm or hair relaxation. Okay. Because I finally, myself, got in control of the expansion and contraction of hair, mm -hmm. and that's what, that's what got my eye in the big market of New York. Okay. I saw that I was onto something uh, 
it was a great ride, but here we're back again, 30 years later, mm-hmm. I'm correcting the damage I had you caused in the first place. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so with the, with the Cure product, can hairstylists use this during and after a chemical service in the salon? And can clients purchase this as an at-home uh, product? Absolutely, Brad. Uh, mm-hmm. I, I was just up in New York, New Jersey, uh, mm-hmm. back the first of the year. And the one concern that stylist had is that the time it took to do these different deep conditioning treatments. Mm-hmm. Well, I ask you, what is a deep conditioning treatment? Yeah. It's just a thicker, more bonding agent that has to use heat that takes 45 minutes to an hour. Mm-hmm. Uh, whatever the, the case study is, it's about yes. bonding a particular, particular material on there. Mm-hmm. Mine happens with BioVita as soon as it hits the hair. Okay. So, and the salon, the, the first thing you would want to do, and they're all numbered, by the way, on one, two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. One, two, three are corrective, four and five are styling within BioVita. Okay. But regardless of your hair type, your ethnicity, the physical integrity of the hair, mm-hmm. what we correct. We make it the way it was when you first started out. You want to clean the hair, number one, thoroughly. You want to get mm-hmm. everything off. And it, you've heard a lot. I'll speak shortly about it. Mm-hmm. Uh, the no uh, sulfate trend yes. that's running around. Mm-hmm. Uh, have you ever wondered why they don't want you to use sulfates? No. Usually people believe that no sulfate must be safer on their hair. Okay. that That is where the misinformation comes from. When you're working with bonding agents, they can't use a very good cleansing product because that would strip off the material that's coating mm. the hair. And when you get into conditioning uh, cleansers, which I don't understand how you clean and condition at the same time. At the time, same time, yes. <laughs> that, that's just putting more goop on the hair. Mm-hmm. If you come in with a, a, a sodium laurel or, or sulfate, mm-hmm. you're getting a very good detergent action. You want yes. to clean it off. Understand with BioVita, you've mm-hmm. already contracted the cuticle. You don't have to mm-hmm. worry about shampooing the color out. Yes. But what happens is sulfates are the best cleansing, cleansing agents out there. In fact, mm-hmm. if your hair doesn't suds, that's primarily what it does. It causes mm-hmm. a suds, sudsing action. Yes. And if you don't get that, it's because your hair is still oily. Because okay. a lot of times people don't shampoo for four or five days mm-hmm. a week. You know, depending yes. on your, their lifestyle. So mm-hmm. the scalp oil, everything builds up and you've got all this styling stuff and masking agents and mm-hmm. you just have a ton of buildup. Yes. So what we do, we want to strip that off. We want to mm-hmm. clean the hair of all that product. Then I come in with a product number two, sleek. Mm-hmm. This is when you get into moisture moisturization, which yeah. you could not do previously because the barriers of mm-hmm. uh, the coating agents wouldn't allow moisture to react mm-hmm. with the hair. Yes. So uh, one thing about clean, it's great for disrupting viruses. Mm-hmm. I use it on my hair <laughs> and my body. That's yeah. the best thing about sulfates. They yeah. disrupt viruses. So I've used it for my hair and my body for a while. But when we mm-hmm. come back now, we want to introduce number two, sleek, which mm-hmm. what that does is that goes in and I embed that at the base of the cuticle and I okay. put in a moisture management and a shape mm-hmm. memory molecule in there. You're familiar. Uh, well, not to get it too technical here, Mm -hmm. but I established something in there. And then I come back with number three, cure. Mm -hmm. And what that does, that activates that, physically shuts the cuticle down, Mm -hmm. holding on to a a moisture management system Ah. that remains in the hair for days, into weeks, into months. Mm -hmm. We just want clean hair. Think about the women with fine hair Mm -hmm. or anybody with fine hair. The number one problem is collapse. Yes. Well, when you're force fed and you have to choose four different types of products and those are different levels of oils in shampoo. Mm-hmm. Yes. So this would be good for fine hair. This would be good for Latin hair. This would be good for uh, more ethnic Afro-American mm-hmm. hair. This would be good for ginger hair, you know, yes. or whatever the te- or Italian hair, whatever mm-hmm. the texture is, they're dosing you different levels of coating agents and you go through this discovery process to find out which one works best for you Mm -hmm. because let's face it the two reasons people buy products is because of what the smell is and how slippery does it make the hair feel Mm -hmm. they spend so much money on packaging 
and advertising that a lot of time quality was left out of the formulation or not even known. Mm -hmm. So it was my purpose to step aside from the regular manufacturing techniques and discover something new that made sense because this is kind of simple. Don't you agree? I mean, if we're just going to neutralize with something that's equal to and stronger than we're going to mm -hmm. shut it down. Mm -hmm. Then if you need to use heavier products like a pomade or yes. a gel or whatever your styling technique, mm -hmm. do not confuse styling mm -hmm. products with hair maintenance products. Yes. There are two different processes. Mm -hmm. One, two, three it, it, with, with clean, sleek, and cure. That corrects anybody's hair instantly. You can count mm -hmm. on that. You know, and, and so that's kind of where the brand is mm -hmm. as far as that. With, with BioBeta, we have a number four, which is a design. Mm -hmm. uh, and what that is, I'm, I'm the matter of fact, I have very fine hair. I call this the island. I really don't. Okay. <laughs> I make it look yep. four because I'm not weighing it down. Mm -hmm. And a matter of fact, I just style it. How's it looking, Brad? Uh, yeah, it looks it looks okay, great. We're doing okay. It looks great. So yes, yeah. Is, with, with fine hair, you're dumped a lot of stuff. You got to put it on. It weighs it mm -hmm. down. And remember, when the hair is swollen, those cuticles are locking together, and those bonding agents hold groups of hairs together. So yes. it clumps together. When you release the hair of the weight, each hair mm -hmm. goes to its respective position on the scalp, and yes. you have a fuller bouffant. Then, mm -hmm. based on the thickness, type, texture of your hair, we go in and determine how much design it needs, how much support, mm -hmm. softness, and shine. So I go in with 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 uh, design, mm -hmm. and I use like four or five sprays, and then mm -hmm. I go through and rub it in the hair. I want to yes. move it around the hair. Mm -hmm. you use less is best is the, yes. the word for BioBeta. You know that mm -hmm. less is best because they're very expensive and effective mm -hmm. chemicals. So I use four or five, somebody that has a bigger curl, needs more support, mm -hmm. you wanna use more, Yes. you know? But you determine mm -hmm. the softness, control, and shine that you need for your hair, not because you're force-fed products out of the first section of cleaning and, mm -hmm. and making the hair feel better. Number, exactly. five, uh, number five is something called keep, and that's what mm -hmm. it does. Once you've designed your, your greatness, you mm -hmm. want to keep the style. Now, this is a humidity-proof hairspray. Mm -hmm. You can go in and spray it on. You build up to where you have the uh, hold that you want. Mm -hmm. One thing that's unique about this, because it is a true clean line, Brad, yes. if you didn't like the style you did, I could go back mm -hmm. with number one cure. Mm -hmm. I could spray it on my hair, mm -hmm. come back, re-blow dry it, yes. go back and lock it back down, and there's no gubbiness, no stickiness. Mm -hmm. When you get out in humidity, it doesn't revert back to the curl or back mm -hmm. to whatever. This is a true holding system, and that's number four and five. So you have one through three, correct? And by mm -hmm. the way, this shampoo mm -hmm. and sleep work very fast. They, it works yes. instantly on the hair. Agreed? Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah you don't have to go in the shower, leave it on five, ten minutes, wait, go under a cap. Or is there something that you recommend for somebody who use it who uses the um the conditioning agent for the very first time? So if they use sleek for the very first time, should they leave it in a little bit longer on the first time? It's best to, Brad. You leave it yep. in about five or ten minutes. And that establishes it's almost like doing oh, it is like doing a hair service. Okay. Uh, here, here's your color. Here's your activator. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So, but we're working in correcting the damage. You can't really correct unnatural hair damage. No. With natural products. Mm -hmm. You know, it just doesn't work. These are uh, all derived. They're all natural. I've used the chemicals in here for over 50 years. Mm -hmm. Oh, excuse me. Over 40 years. Yes. I've had experiments. So we're all FDA approved, uh, all organically sourced. And then we go in and we tweak things. Like mm -hmm. you said, Born in nature, refined yes. with science. That's what we did. They're very safe. In fact, with Cure, I use it to tan with. I don't. I, oh I, wow! I, yeah, <laughs> because we're talking about inflammation here. Exactly. Like yeah. what causes the problem? Like leaky gut. All mm -hmm. the things that cause inflammation are always the problem. Yes. So if you burn, your skin swells. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? In the research I've done in hair, skin, and nails. 
I just spray this on the skin. It doesn't allow the skin to swell, so there's no blister. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? If you Perfect. if you do burn and you mm -hmm. get home, you better go in and hit it mm -hmm. because that's going to contract the swelling. It's all about yes. control of the swelling, whether it's in the hair, the skin, or the nail. Mm -hmm. Even in the horse line that you know that I have, so many yes. horse curves have been corrected because of mm -hmm. that thick cuticle damage from nailing. So mm -hmm. uh, that's another video, of course, with Claude. Yeah. But the point is, we found a way for a novice, mm -hmm. to a person at home, to a professional stylist, to go in and be control of the hair for the first time ever without yes. having a confusion. Because mm -hmm. that's the big problem of not knowing that you don't know what you're doing. That was my exactly. problem. And I solved it. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And myself being in the industry for decades, I've used a lot of different products and my hair itself used to be a lot thicker. Now it's a lot finer. And I have been using your line. And what I found from the very first use is that my hair, because of COVID, now it's halfway down my back. So it's pretty long. But, <laughs> but after using the shampoo, I found after using clean, I had three times more hair. I didn't feel like I had any buildup at all. It basically feels your hair is like air. And right. for me, the same sort of thing. You always feel like you have some kind of coating on there. You have some kind of something. And what I, and what I also found too, that is when I was, when I, since I've been using this, um, I used to have a lot of hair loss. Now it's basically almost zero when I, when I comb it or whatever. Uh, I'm not sure if that's part of it, but for me, that's what I found. It reduced any kind of hair loss I had because normally I would comb and a lot of hair would come out. Now I find there's nothing on the comb. Well, Brad, you've hit on something that I don't talk about, but since you brought mm -hmm. it up, I will. Yeah. Uh, as I told you, I developed BioVita Bio products for me mm -hmm. to enhance my life, yes. whether it's the hair, the hemp, or the horse. Mm -hmm. uh, it just gave value to my life. Uh, and I should not really have hair up here. Mm -hmm. I've got some old pictures. As a matter of fact, I was just going through some old pictures and my buddy who helps me in the chemical processing, he said, Jonathan, you've had a tremendous, a lot of growth right up here because yes. this is already filled in. And I, I don't want to go yeah. in making claims on that because then you get no. into three letter agencies. And exactly. Problem. Yeah. But, I'm, just, I'm just speaking. Yeah. From my own personal experience, not claim but, anything, but I know from the time that I started to now that, that we're speaking um, and just say, I wouldn't use anything else now since I've used BioVita, I would not or will not use anything else because wow. I, I saw the, I saw the results interest. Uh, I saw the results instantly. And for me, because I do, I educate all across Canada, the US, I do film, television, video work. I've worked with a ton of companies and I know what the products are like. But since I've tried this one, nothing else that I've used before compares to BioVita. Well, you, you've hit on a couple of things here and I'll just, I'll, I'll add to it shortly. Mm -hmm. When you're coating your hair to mask the damage with whatever claim there is mm -hmm. you're also coating the scalp yes. agreed mm -hmm. okay so this is where a lot of problems come from you're coated you're not allowing the hair as well as the scalp to breathe mm -hmm. and have moisture interaction yes another thing these products that you coat and bond the hair with they're like a magnet for pollutants mm -hmm. for pollen and what yes. happens when you come in you you put that in your pillow and you rub mm -hmm. that in your pillow, and you wonder why you have allergies or, or types of mm -hmm. things up in your sinuses. When you yes. use a clean line like, like BioVita's Clean, you do experience that the first time. Mm -hmm. You do feel the difference. Yes. I know it's a little uncomfortable learning a new technique. Mm -hmm. Let's face it, we're fine doing what we're doing. We don't want to yes. change. But if you don't evolve, mm -hmm. then you've not you've not created a better hair for yourself. Yes. I've been a part of the, the future of evolution of hair chemistry since mm -hmm. 1982. Mm -hmm. I've worked in the background with labs and companies, major companies, including Claro, mm -hmm. and in the discovery process. And I've added a lot of great products that you do know. Mm -hmm. And I was never in the forefront of those companies. Yes. It was just at my point in life, I felt, let me have one more last tour for the road. Mm -hmm. Let me go out and, because in life, Brad, and, and you're, you're a great life wisdom coach, and that's one mm -hmm. thing that attracted me to you. It's mm -hmm. about lifting people up yes. to be who they're meant to be. 
because there's two things in life that are great. Number mm -hmm. one, when you're born, but yeah. number two, when you find out why. And mm -hmm. through all of my life experiences, I found out all those jobs, all those people, I now have a relationship with all my clientele. Mm -hmm. I yes. understand what their lifestyle is. I mm -hmm. knew what they needed. And that's what I provided with BioVita. Something mm -hmm. that they could have a product that has integrity, yes. number one. But more importantly, it gives you a return on investment. Mm -hmm. In fact, that's one thing. When you look at this little four-ounce bottle of Cure, I like the mm -hmm. four-ounce because it fits on. You come out of the shower, you shampoo it, and did the sleep. It's you come perfect. Out, you hit it with a few sprays of that. Yep. You know, oh my gosh, it's five products. I, oh, so, so somebody said to me, oh, it's five mm -hmm. products. I go, wait a minute. This mm -hmm. is a few sprays. This is a couple more sprays. Mm -hmm. Move it around with design, and then you lock it up. What, yes. Just five seconds? You know? Yes. And that I, change mm -hmm. to get people in that well, uh, differentiation with purpose. Mm -hmm. What does BioVita do for you that causes you to move into learn the new technique yes to feel a better mm -hmm. hair to, mm -hmm. to create a whole new you only better because yes. maybe it's not the haircut mm -hmm. maybe it's not the hair color maybe it's not the curl or straight mm -hmm. maybe it's just the feeling of having great hair for the exactly first time in your life mm -hmm. and feel, so i've added another layer mm -hmm. of, of hairstyling and you can do it simply at your home or in the salon, but I would never do a hair color with at least not having cure. And that starch feeling that you get in color, per, uh, perms also, but, mm -hmm. but in color and bleaching where it clumps together, it feels like straw. You know, as soon as you mm -hmm. put on, uh, on uh, number two, sleek, it breaks that down. You yes. now have a supply soft because we're not coating. We're mm -hmm. going into the hair and we're correcting. So it, it's a whole new, uh, it's a whole new ball game, Brad, and I'm glad to uh, be sharing this time with mm -hmm. you. Enlighten people that just don't have a clue. No, uh, it, it, like to better. exactly. And I find because I don't have the the way down. A lot of times I would shampoo, and especially when your hair is finer. You think you need to shampoo more often because you wash your hair the next day. It's greasy because of the layers of the the product. But I found because I have naturally curly hair, I found over the years it started going wavy. But when I started using the Bio, Bio Vita, my hair came back. So right. imagine me now with three times of the hair like this. Right. So oh, that's yeah. what it looks like before <laughs> I slick it down, right? And that's what I – and another thing, because myself, I'm so sensitive to fragrance. That's one thing I actually love about this because it doesn't have a strong, pungent, perfumey, overpowering. And the same with a lot of my clients because a lot of my clients that I do – they, they love green products. They love organic products. They love, you know, equally sourced products. So this line for them is perfect because now they found something they can use, and especially clients with finer hair, then they're able to use it and not have it weighted down. Believe me, I've tried, I've tried the, the clean as a body wash. I've tried the cure on my skin. <laughs> I've done, but it's nice that you have a system that you can truly customize. If you need more moisture, you can add more moisture. If you need less, but I find even if I just clean and, and uh, I don't necessarily always need sleek or I don't always need some other things, I find my hair is still really soft after that. And that's why I find with clean, um, my hair feels really light, but nothing feels like it's stripped. It doesn't right. feel dry. It doesn't feel stripped. It doesn't feel brittle. You know what I mean? And, and to me, uh, the, the thing I love about the sleek, it is an experience in the shower. Because once I smell that, um, because years ago I trained as a natural builder and I used to live in the woods for about five months in a tent, that brings me back to that time. So every time I use it, it it's, it's a neurological anchor that takes me there. So that's why for me, it, I, really, I really enjoy it, right? <laughs> I, I'm much appreciative to hear that because we haven't yeah. discussed this since you used the product. So I had no, no. idea what kind of results you got. This is oh, very yes. heartwarming. And one thing yeah. you hit on, mm -hmm. uh, the hair stays cleaner longer. It does, yeah. So you don't have to shampoo as often. And mm -hmm. that's the problem why you get into this cycle and you never get off of that because now I, I did my hair, I got through it. It was, took me an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. 
and, and God, I don't want to do that tomorrow or the next day. I'll wait till the next day. And then the next mm -hmm. day comes and then, oh, well, I'll wait till tomorrow because it's yes. such a chore. It's such mm -hmm. a chore to deal with hair management when you cannot yes. control it right. So being that I'm not coating the hair with mm -hmm. anything, I'm correcting internally. Exactly. Uh, that allows it to stay long, uh, cleaner longer so you really can go for that full week and your mm -hmm. third day bed head and your fourth yes. day bed head and your fifth day bed head is mm -hmm. full and voluminous and yes. shiny. In fact, when you have those products that are coating, mm -hmm. it's like a filter. And yes. I see a lot of our Kool-Aid color friends, mm -hmm. you know, the, the rainbow colors. Yeah, and, that's stri and it strips very easy. And they keep recommending sulfate-free shampoos to keep it washing cold water, wash maybe once a week so that color doesn't fade, right? Any of those direct well, dyes? We know how to, to hold on to it from the beginning and yes. make it like, again, the pink to the red. Mm -hmm. We not only hold on to that color, but we mm -hmm. make it more brilliant because now light is refracting off of the hair. Yes. Mm -hmm. you, because that's how we see the color. Light comes in and it mm -hmm. bounces off rather than travel through. Yes. And I mm -hmm. see a lot of dirty hair. I call mm -hmm. it chicken fried blonde <laughs> and redneck red. Yes. That's yes. some Texas talk <laughs> in Fort Worth days. Maybe yes. I shouldn't have said that, but you know what I'm talking about. Yes, yes, It's yes. about the frustration of just mm -hmm. working in hair. And if a simple guy like me out of Fort Worth, Texas mm -hmm. can go from – being out of the beauty school and in four years getting Clarell's senior position on Park Avenue yes. as a senior mm -hmm. colorist because I knew more than mm -hmm. anybody else in the chemical yes. field. And they mm -hmm. recognized that. At that yes. time, we couldn't really translate what my ideas were. Mm -hmm. But in fact, here we are. It's a complete line. And I'm very yes. proud to present it to the globe. Yeah, it's amazing. So as we as we wrap up, I want to give them a little teaser. So we're doing the Holy uh, Trinity, the three podcasts. So the next two, so a little bit, uh, a little teaser quickly about your hemp line and your, your quad line. So then people uh, listening to this can come back. We'll also get an email address. So if people are interested in the BioVita, we'll have the link below uh, so they can visit the website. But if they have any questions for you personally, uh, where should they come? contact you just write me jonathan j-o-n-a-t-h-a-n jonathan at biovita b-i-o-v-e-t-a dot com and i'll get that uh i'm watching everything so if it gets in through info at the biovita i'll still see it, still but jonathan, it. I, directly to me but yeah brad this has been uh, an interesting experience three years ago real quick mm -hmm. uh i had gotten injured i was having advanced arthritis pain mm -hmm. and I. Uh, the VA had me on so many uh, opiates, okay. uh, and I wasn't good with that. Mm -hmm. And so I got into the hemp space with some okay. people I know in an upper level space yes. in the industry. They they awakened me like with the hair side to mm. what the hemp side was really about. Okay. I developed several products that make my life better. In fact, oh, in yeah. three years, I haven't had a pain pill or an aspirin or anything. Wow. I, I, I use my blend. I, that's a truthful yep. statement. I did have yeah. a tooth taken out recently. Mm -hmm. I'm learning yep. how to talk again. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I did that, and that reminded me the days that I went through those opiate days, mm -hmm. which I was yep. miserable. I was argumentative. I was mm -hmm. just, I was a beast. And yes. uh, since that time, uh, I found out how to balance me, because mm -hmm. quite frankly, I used to be more starburst than the Milky Way at times. Okay. <laughs> and, you know how we get. Uh, yes. Now I'm on the same page all the time. Mm -hmm. It allowed me to just have a better life and also mm -hmm. created a sleep product. By the way, I've got the new uh, sleep shoes. Oh, amazing. Came in. amazing. I've got to get you some of those because sometimes yeah. you need something that really knocks you out. Yes. Uh, and that's what it, the, the, you know, the L-theanine mm -hmm. and the GABA mm -hmm. along with the 10 milligram CBD full spectrum yes. grown from seed, no THC with that product. I mm -hmm. do have tea based products as well, but mm -hmm. with this one, it's, it's uh, going into some hospitals. So I had yes. to keep this really uh, up to standard mm -hmm. and the new one with melatonin just allowed me to have that mm -hmm. final uh, product to stop my brain from dancing at night because mm -hmm. I'm always working for like you we're always yes. working. sometimes you need to stop the dance and get some rest mm -hmm. uh, so that's what I did and that led to uh, along the hairline a friend of mine was using uh, the hair system on his horse oh and wow I, I knew what okay. he do for the horse in yes. hair you see it mac microscopically doing good on a horse mm -hmm. you see it just all over the canvas 
uh, mm -hmm. because you see what it does to the coat. What sleep does to the coat of a horse, mm -hmm. it turns it into just a supple velvet. There's no yes. tangles in the tail. Uh, there's no need for a fly spray because if you think about those proteins and hair pumps, mm -hmm. and if you're around horses, you know what I'm talking about. There's always a need for a fly spray. That's mm -hmm. because the proteins that have now gone rancid because they can't put enough formaldehyde in it yes. legally yes. to stop it from going the bacteria going bad because you mm -hmm. do understand the mm -hmm. hydrolyzed keratin protein does yes. come from cows, hides, hooves, horse, mm -hmm. feathers, pig's blood. And they oh. dissolve it, they extract it, and that's what mm -hmm. they're filling in between your hair and all yes. over the horse coach. So that is a buffet for flies. Oh. They, they <laughs> smell dead protein. And <laughs> so when, when you're mm -hmm. removing, and that's what I've done in the horse quad yes. as well, remove all that. I can go from a dry horse to a show-ready horse in mm -hmm. 30 minutes or less. Yeah, and that's so, amazing. And I'm sure that people want to listen to, you know, that that coming up. But as we wrap up now, I want to say thank you for your, your time, Jonathan. I know you're a busy guy coming on today. We got two more podcasts coming. So the next time we're going to talk all about your hemp line and say what it can do for you. I'll explain what it did for me. Um, so it's – I'm so glad that everybody joined us today. So make sure to like, share, subscribe. So if you go to biovita.com, Jonathan has graciously, for anybody who goes on biovita.com, if you put in the code BRAD10, you'll, everybody who's listening that uses that code will get 10% off. So you can try the Biovita pro BioVita products. You can also message Jonathan at jonathanbiovita.com and he'll respond to you as soon as he gets your message. If you have any questions, anything like that, we'll also link it in the video as well or below if it's on the audio podcast. So I want to say thank you for joining us today, Jonathan, and I'll see everyone next time.